Wear the Gown, brought to you by CHI St. Vincent. If there is one common denominator we've seen in all of our gown stories, it's how chronic pain changes people. Here's a prime example. The story of a woman who loves fishing and playing sports with her grandkids is turned into literally a couch potato. Here's Craig O'Neill. Well, it may say CHI St. Vincent Heart Clinic, but you'd think it was an airport when Dale Smith gets there. She immediately takes off her shoes, not for security, but for peace of mind. It's hard to explain the pain leading from starting with the leg all the way up. A chronic pain that got so bad, she thought the unthinkable. I even thought about, you know, disability. I was really thinking, oh, I'm just, I can't walk, can't do nothing. Hey, Hi, Dr. Gauthier. How are you? Hi. I'm good. Intervening in all of this, because after all, he's an interventional cardiologist, Dr. Yezon Gauthier. Sounds good. That sounds, I love that sound. This was the test that helped solve the mystery. It's called ankle brachial index. Eventually, it was determined Dale had peripheral arterial disease, a narrowing of the arteries primarily in the leg. And when you start walking and the limbs start moving, they ask for more blood. And when the arteries narrow, it can't supply more blood. And that's where pain comes in. It hit Dale hard. She is very active. I like to play sports with the kids. And I have 13 grandkids. Dr. Gaucher reviewed Dale's tests, crunched the numbers, and ultimately she got a procedure done that meant staying still for seven hours. That's tough for her. But within a month at her workplace. One day I did like a double shift. I worked from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. at night. I get back run. to work? I'm definitely back to work. Now before we celebrate this happy ending, you need to know this peripheral arterial disease, or PAD, is widespread. One out of eight adults above 60 have some evidence of peripheral arterial disease. That translates to millions of people, many of whom have no idea it's happening. Make sure you keep your regular checkups with your doctor. So take off your shoes and socks whenever you go see your primary care physician. This way they can uh, examine your pulses, look for non-healing ulcers, and there are early signs which can detect peripheral arterial disease. Doctors at CHI St. Vincent have stressed that this condition is one of the most one that most patients don't even know they have. But one telltale sign is increasing pain in the legs after just a short walk. There are other signs and we've listed them in the gown section under the features tab on THV11.com.